to visit, tell me doctor, am I really sick? He said I'm showing characteristics of being a snobby bitch. Yeah, I'm a what is up y'all and welcome back to my channel in today's video i'm going to be doing a fall try on clothing haul for you guys today before i go ahead and get started with this video please make sure you like this video subscribe to my channel if you aren't already and go ahead and click the notification bell so you can be notified every time i post the video all right y'all so i ordered all these clothes myself with my own money i got these clothes from shein i got these clothes from a pretty little thing and I got two pair of jeans from Fashion Nova. I just got two because nobody told me Fashion Nova jeans were so expensive. So I just got two pair of jeans and I kind of paired them up with everything that I had because I did want to keep every um, item that I used still within the haul. So if you see the same pair of jeans over and over again, I told you why. Hair is jacked up because I changed clothes like seven, eight, nine, ten different times. So having to pull everything over my head, mess my hair up. So my hair looks bad. You know why I did this for y'all. Let me show you guys some shirts that I got, mostly shirts, um, some jeans that I got from Fashion Nova, shoes that I got from Pretty Little Thing, and also some shirts that I got from Pretty Little Thing as well. I got a majority of uh, shirts versus like outfits or jeans or anything like that because I feel like shirts can go with whatever I already have. And I spent like $300, so I might as well spend $300 on something that I can wear, you know, with a lot more things. I had to spend three hundred dollars on something I can wear with more than one thing. Um, everything that I got in this haul today is a small or extra small. That's just the size that I wear. And the pants that I have are a size three because I'm small and I ain't got no butt. So, woo. Okay, so for this outfit, it is basically just a off the shoulder orange top that I got from Shein. The pants that I have on are from Fashion Nova. This is like one of my favorite tops that I did get from this haul. It is super cute, super comfortable, super soft on the inside. Like, y'all, I love this shirt so much. It's just like unbearable. So this top is kind of a crop sweater. It's cropped, but it's not cropped. Or either it's cropped and my body's just short because I am only like 5'3". And I got it to pair with like maybe... I have pink Uggs that matches, so I'm probably going to do that. I got it to dress up or dress down. Basically, everything I have in this fall haul is to dress up or dress down. Okay, so I got this blue top. And it's kind of small. It's a size extra small. I don't know why I decided to get that one in extra small anyway because I do have breasts. I don't got butt, but I got boobies. So I got this and... It's a little small. It fits good enough. It's not small to where it like hurts, but it's small to where like it's kind of tight on the arms and stuff like that. So I can work around that. I'm still gonna wear it because I pay for it. All right. So this is just a super basic uh, gray top slash hoodie type material. I really don't know what to call it, so I'm just gonna call it a gray top. Um, it's also cropped. I got a whole lot of cropped stuff because I did buy a pair of high waist pants. Okay, so this is basically just an orange hoodie. I mean, it really has no other special characteristics about it. Just a basic orange hoodie. Um, I was going to get it oversized so I could wear it also as a sweater dress slash hoodie dress. But I decided to go ahead and get it in a small. That way I can just wear it every day. Okay, so this shirt, I actually forgot how it looked on the website. But it's too big for me, number one. It is a small, but if it's super big, um, I don't like that. And I forgot how I'm supposed to tie it. I don't do good with things that need to be tied. That's I probably should stop buying clothes that require tying or knots of any kind but whatever okay so this is just a super square neckline uh shirt that i got it's just something that's also i'm wearing these jeans from fashion okay so i got this super cute like business casual could be dressy but not too dressy silk satin looking button-up shirt and y'all don't think I'm slow, please. I try so hard to button up the arm piece and I cannot do it by myself and my mama is not home to button it for me. I know that sounds so crazy, but I really cannot button it. It's supposed to be buttoned. Trust me, I know it's supposed to be buttoned. So please don't comment and be like, why didn't you button up the sleeves? I know the sleeves supposed to be buttoned. I already had it on. I didn't want to take it off, button the sleeves, put it back on. So it's a really good material. It's really soft. It's satin on the outside and it's not see-through. Oh my gosh, y'all, I was so scared I was going to have to put on a cami with this. It is not see-through at all. It is a full material shirt, so you really can just throw it on and go. This is just a pink butterfly hoodie, and they had a regular pink hoodie, kind of like the orange one that I have, but I thought the butterfly was cute, so I got the one with the butterfly on it. 
and it is actually a really thin material so if you want a hoodie to throw on when it's actually cold outside i wouldn't recommend this one i would recommend this for you know early fall when it's still kind of warm a little bit but not too warm because it is super thin um also it's not see-through but it's this close to being see-through so i would wear it with a cami it's not one of those hoodies that you can throw on you know without a bra or without a cami up under it all right so this shirt is super cute y'all it has the detail at the neckline which i really love um i went ahead and i paired it with these boots from pretty little thing okay y'all this color block sweater which i think that's what it's called i cannot recall this sweater is so hard to get over my head i don't know if i just got a big head or what but i literally was struggling for like 15 minutes to try to get this over my head so keep that in mind if you are planning on buying this shirt the neckline is like this big so if you got a big head don't even don't even do it to yourself okay so this is kind of just like another uh not color block but striped sweater it is super cute it fits a lot smaller than the other one that I had on the color block one, the orange one it fits smaller than that which I actually kind of like because I really don't like oversized clothes that much unless I'm intentionally trying to make it oversized okay y'all now we gonna look grown hey arrow this shirt is from pretty little thing and it is a red shirt it got the little cleavage hanging out a little boobies popping out you know because we are grown <laughs> Yeah. I paired this with the high waist pants and I also paired it with some boots that I got from Route 21. No, Route 21 is not in this haul. I just wanted to wear these shoes. This shirt grown is sexy. So I wanted to put on some grown sexy shoes. Y'all, pretty little thing is true to size because this is a small and it fit like a small. It fit my cleavage, it fit my shoulders, it fit everything perfectly. With chin, the small can either fit a little big or a little small. All right, y'all, so this shirt right here is a tie around shirt. And like I said before, I don't do good with things that need to be tied up. I'm not good at tying, okay? I didn't even know how to tie my shoes when I was a kid for the longest. And I used to tie it weird. I used to take two of the bows and do like this and do like that instead of wrapping it around doing like that. This shirt is from Pretty Little Thing. And I have paired it with those same Fashion Nova jeans. And also the boots that I have on are from Pretty Little Thing too. So this shirt, I ain't even gonna lie. I don't like it. Um, I got this from Shein and I can't remember how I was supposed to tie it. So, I just gave up on it. I'm not going to spend too much time on this one because I don't like it. Sorry. Alright, y'all. So, please do not tell me how bad I look in this. I don't care because I already know. Um, I bought this cropped uh, hoodie type whatever thing. And I cannot find my tank top that I had designed to go with it. I was going to wear it with a tank top or a onesie and I can't find either one. So, I kind of just threw on a random tank top, stuffed it in my pants to give the illusion. <laughs> Of having on a onesie. I just wanted to show y'all the uh, cropped shirt and then also the shoes because it's a pretty little thing. Oh, and I got the shoes from Pretty Little Thing. So I'm gonna keep, I'm gonna match something up. Something gonna match. So this dress and turtleneck combo is from Shein. This dress is a small, but I needed an extra small. As you can see, if it's super big. But I went ahead and I paired this with some fishnet stockings that I also got from Shein. Um, I also switched them out for some knee-high socks that I bought from Shein as well. I'm probably not going to wear it with the fishnets. I'm probably going to wear it with the stockings, if anything. I got the fishnets to go with a skirt and um, a pair of super ripped up jeans that I was going to get from Boohoo, but I ended up not ordering them, so I'll just keep the fishnets. So I just wanted to show you guys this uh, turtleneck that I have that I got from Shein as well. I also got this jacket. It's supposed to be an oversized uh, trench coat type thing. And I'm not even going to lie to y'all, it's paper thin. I really don't like it that much. But um, for fashion purposes or picture purposes, I'm definitely going to wear it. This was also one of the most expensive things in my cart, so I'm definitely going to wear it. But I got that, and it's it's cool. It's all right. I just don't really like the material that much. It kind of feels cheap, but that's whatever. All right, y'all, so this is one of my favorite outfits, and it's also the one that I'm wearing right now for you guys, which is this two-piece set that I got from Shein, and it is in baby pink. I mean, uh, blush pink. <laughs> My bad. It is in blush pink, and it is, oh, can't give. Honestly, I'm probably going to go back in and order more two-piece sets because I love stuff like this that I can just throw on with some Uggs or just with some regular sneakers and just go on about my day. Usually, I wouldn't wear this with a bra. Not even going to lie to y'all. But my mom said, don't get on the camera looking nasty with no bra on. So I was like, okay, mom, I ain't going to get on the camera looking nasty with no bra on. So I decided to go ahead and uh, put a bra on with that and kind of like tuck the uh, straps down in it. 
because knowing me, I don't really like wearing bras, so I definitely will free the nipple in this outfit and not care. So that is the end of my haul video. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. I will leave all the links to the items down below. If you did like this video, please make sure you like this video. So subscribe to my channel and turn on the post notification bell so you can be notified every time I post a video. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.